Well, artificial intelligence is quickly becoming a part of everyday life. And even though that might sound scary, some reports show it can be a big boost for small businesses. Yeah, I spoke with Jordan Crenshaw, the senior vice president of the U.S. Chamber of Commerce Technology Engagement Center, about how small business owners can use AI to their advantage. This is an interesting topic. AI, of course, it is this burgeoning topic that is talked about in, in many facets of life now. But I, I'm curious to know how it's affecting small businesses and currently how is AI being used in small businesses? Well, AI is really a force multiplier and it's enabling small businesses who typically don't have the same resources and staff as a larger company to compete. Nearly all small businesses are using a tool powered by AI, like accounting software, like QuickBooks or payments. Uh, but 40% are using cutting edge generative AI to market products and create images for advertising or interact with their customers. You know, a lot of people that are scared of, of the evolution of AI, you know, they talk about AI coming for jobs. You know, what, where does this argument stand? Do we have an answer on how AI is being used and, and is it eliminating jobs or just making jobs easier to do? Well, one of the things that we asked uh, in this report of small businesses uh, was, are you hiring more than you were last year? And um, when companies, uh, small businesses uh, were higher adopters of technology, um, they actually saw increased uh, the hiring rates year over year compared to their peers who weren't using uh, AI uh, enabled tools. So I, I think that's uh, really encouraging to see as companies are growing, uh, they're able to bring on more staff and technology is helping companies start up uh, with, with uh, limited resources. So that's a good thing. Um, and as, as small businesses continue to use these tools, we're, we're just scratching the surface of, of the benefits we can see. Yeah, I mean, speak to that. You know, how can the adoption of this kind of technology, you know, help small businesses and, and, and be successful? Well, a few areas um, we've seen small businesses said that AI is helping them with cyber threats. It's helping them with inflation. It's helping them uh, find uh, less costly uh, resources uh, and, and supplies so that they don't have to pass costs on to consumers. But I think overall, nearly 90% of small businesses using AI are optimistic it will help them grow. And that same number uh, has said AI has helped them enjoy running their business. And I, and I chatted with one coffee shop owner uh, who runs a uh, coffee shop by himself. Um, and uh, it's a family operation from past one. And, and what he said was this, is that AI has helped him cut his marketing time down by 70%. So that helps him. Uh, do the job of making the best cup of coffee he can for his community. And he's not having to deal with a lot of the back end logistics work that the bigger companies could hire teams to do. And so it's really providing a leg up for small businesses uh, who don't have the same resources. Yeah, fascinating. Okay, you talked about the report that the U.S. Chamber of Commerce released. Just any other findings that you think are worth highlighting out of that report, especially, you know, with that small business factor in mind? Well, what we found is that the more small businesses try out and know about AI, the more they see its benefits. But at the same time, they're concerned uh, that regulations could inhibit their ability to use AI um, if, if, if we uh, give into more fear mongering. And 86 percent of small businesses are, are concerned about proposed technology regulations harming their ability to grow. Uh, we've seen states like Colorado pass AI laws that small businesses are confused about in terms of whether or not they're even going to have to comply with the law. Um, only one third of small businesses feel they're very prepared to deal with new AI regulations, which means most are not. Uh, and so and that's why it's so critical that federal and state governments uh, need to address AI from perspective of avoiding passing one size fits all laws that harm small businesses and deprive them of valuable AI tools. Jordan, appreciate the time. This is an interesting topic to dive into. I'm, I'm glad we had the chance to talk about it here this morning. Thanks, Travis. Study and how AI can be used with small businesses. You can check out uschamber.com slash technology. Interesting stuff. Mm -hmm. Well, it's 739.